Hey guys, Jim Marvin here, and welcome back to today's episode 3 of the Hermit Cop Mod Sauce Mod Pack series. And today, unlike the lag, <laughs> uh, we are going to be uh, doing a lot of cool stuff today. As you can see, I did start working on the quarry, I did do a lot of stuff in here. Uh, what I did is I actually found about, I believe, two diamond, diamond nether bricks, uh, sorry, diamond um, netherrack, and what that means is then ten diamonds. I also found another diamond, just one diamond in this cave that I was in. And then, yeah, so I have, I have about, I think I got 21 diamonds, so I made a few machines, and now I have this quarry right here, which is a 64 by 64 quarry, which I left on for not that long, and it's been producing pretty much a lot of resources. I'm hoping it's going to produce some coal, it produced a few pieces of coal, uh, that I can see right now, but it's, like, it's going as best as it can. I also did a little bit of exploring and found some uh, really, really cool things, actually, that are kind of unique. Uh, still, these guys are filling up. Huh, that sucks. I really want them to fill up. Um, so, yeah, it looks like each one has, like, one piece of coal, nothing special. So what I did is I did a little bit of uh, mining in nether, and I got all this thing called Piles of Ashes. And it turns out you can put these guys in Sterling Engines, and then pretty much you'll be all right, like... Uh, yeah, you just feel right, so it'll just keep on producing all that stuff. I also got a few cool things. I got this thing called the Angel Statue, and this is pretty overpowered. Like, I have no clue what it does. Like, it probably does something, but, um, yeah. What I want to do is, this episode, I'm just going to show you a few things that I did find. I did find, like, I believe, like, 30 mob spawners. Maybe later if I can figure out a way to move them. Because I believe there is a may make like this giant mob spawner room or whatever, so I can get like 50 mob spawners in there and pretty much get a ton of loot. Like I found some um, skeleton zombie spawners, all that stuff, and yeah, so I'm pretty sick, sick about that stuff because now we can do just a ton of stuff with the mod sauce. And yeah, so with this quarry, I'm hoping we're gonna get a few diamonds in here, and then later. Uh, because I did see a few people there getting, like, Mumbo Jumbo, he was uploading his videos, and he did 64 by 64 acquired. He was getting something like stacks and stacks of diamonds, so hopefully we get some diamonds in that quarry. If we do, great, maybe we can make another quarry, maybe make a few. Uh, then what I want to do is make, like, a wall where, like, quarry areas are down here, and then I'll, like, start building over over here where my base is in me and everything like that. When you come to the base, I won't lie, I kind of did a little bit of things with it. Um, so, yeah, let's, let's show you my new base. <laughs> you like? <laughs> Look at the base. It's just one giant tree lord, um, just thing. <laughs> it's so gigantic. So what it is, is what I'm going to be doing later is I'm going to be making a lava pub and attaching it to it. But what this pretty much is, it is one gigantic... A uh, tree, and then in that tree, there is like a ton of um, like just the harvesters and everything, uh, just producing all the crops, and they go pretty fast. That should begin to go there, unless it's out. I don't really know. I don't believe so. But yeah, it's pretty much making a ton of resources um, in a short period of time, which I love about this thing. And also, it's like it's so good with replenishing because you can tell by like all this stuff. It's got a ton of um. Just stuff. I'm trying to figure out how I can go in here to check if it's working or not. Um, uh, did I find a gap? Uh, I think I did find some sort of gap. Yeah. Ah, uh, that sucks. Whatever. Uh, so yeah, I pretty much made a little bit of thing here. I'm still working on my windmill power. Um, I don't know. Did I? I don't believe I uploaded this video, but pretty much. What I want to do is work on a, a few machines uh, where pr pretty much I found a way to work on windmills and stuff like that. So now what we can do is we can actually um, start, um, yeah, sky blocked because of the trees. I'm going to have to figure out a way to do that. But I also added this block breaker over here, which is amazing. Uh, this thing just does, like, the best thing ever. Oh, it's not even on. Ooh, I should really turn it on. Yeah, I should really definitely turn this thing on. Um... Where's the torch? Oh, it's down here. Okay. So let's go ahead and just turn this baby on. So I'll show you guys how to do this design really quickly. I might as well uh, go ahead and grab that torch. I believe we just put it back like 
this. There we go. All good. Turn it on. Oh, shit. And, yeah, so we got our machine out. Now you just put a block up there. And then you pretty much get your machine. And you have to make it shoot in there because there's a strange reason. I really don't know why. But um, it's just a little bit fuzzy when doing it. Oh, you can put in wood. That is pretty good instead of coal. Hmm. But, yeah, so pretty much uh, it will. they'll both shoot. And then I'll put cobblestone here. I already filled up this guy, I believe, almost to the top. And, then, yeah, so I'm pretty happy about that. Um, I also got a cactus enchantment table, did some mining, uh, a lot of exploring, a lot of stuff like that, so, yeah, so what I thought of doing, guys, is, first of all, I want to place down this statue, like, right here, because that is pretty overpowered, go ahead and collect a few berries, um, so we do have 30 levels of XP, unfortunately, we don't have, like, a lot of stuff yet, I'm still working on grabbing sugarcane and everything like that, how much do I have now, I got 10 sugarcane, we definitely need to make a sugarcane farm, Maybe this episode, I don't know. But we probably need more resources. Like, I'm getting my, uh... Let's just go over here for a sec. Can I check my polarizer really quickly? Like, oh, good. I found it. So, uh, there's a few... There's just a few things I have right over here. So let's go ahead and just remove our sulfur out of there for a sec. Okay. So, pretty much, we're just polarizing all of this stuff that I can possibly do. And then let's just go ahead and check the chest that we have here. We have some concrete, as you can see. I've been doing a little bit of smelting. We got some uh, shiny ingots, which is pretty cool. Um, a lot of cool stuff in that area, guys. Sorry I didn't do, like, any episodes before. I was just doing a little, a lo oh, sorry, a lot of work on the pack exploring. And the episodes were kind of boring, to be honest, because, um, like, I was just literally in the nether, found diamond ore, got lost. Found another piece of diamond ore, got lost. Then I started finding all this, like, just ores and everything like that. And then I just got, literally, I went the opposite way for, like, the longest time ever. And I was something about, like, 10,000 blocks away. So I had to walk 10,000 blocks back. And then what I had to do is, um, just remember where it was. And I, it took me forever, and I finally remembered. And now I finally got back. And then I worked on the core, I worked on all this stuff. So yeah, it, it took me forever, guys. Um, ooh, just crazy with the amount of stuff I had to do. Uh, I also found a cactus made an enchant uh, enchantment table over here. Um, and yeah, I, I believe I did this guy at last episode. So, let's, let's just go in here. So I just want to show you a few other things. So first of all, this is the... Um, Full of cobblestone, as you can see, so it pretty much piles up in here. So I really don't want this to get full. Unfortunately, this is a weird design. Um, like, it actually glitches a little bit and stops working for a while. Whoa, that lag. Um, but yeah, so it just does all that stuff. Let's go ahead and check our... Um, you see, this thing's never getting any wood in here because it's doing the leaves first, and there's so many leaves. That is pretty much doing that. But what I love is uh, our sludge ball over here. Unfortunately, our generator over here is not working. So you should really go ahead and put some oak woods in that and let that guy burn. Uh, yeah, there we go. Now it's looking like it's working. And the sludge ball, yep, it's working. Look at all this stuff. we got mycelium. I really want to make a mycelium farm, a pod soil farm, some soul sand. Oh, I also got... really take out that soul sand. Um... I also got a few other things in the nether, uh, hopefully this works, I don't really know if I can do this, but, yeah, get out of here, um, what are they, they're, uh, ender lily seeds, I really don't know what they do, I really don't even know, whoa, you can plant them right down here, so that is cool, maybe I'll check if I plant, like, one over here, we'll see, whoa, we'll see how, what we get from it, so I'll plant that one ender lily seed up here, and we'll see what we get from that. Okay, and then these fermented barrels, you can put, like, stuff inside them, and then get stuff back. Um, so there we go. There's our safari net. So let's go ahead and, um, just, wait, where did, oh, did I get the right thing? No, I did not. So I got one nether wart, which is really good. We also... I also found a blaze farm, um, so I really want to go there, do some blaze hunting, uh, and then hopefully with that blaze hunting we can go ahead and make a few other machines that I really want to make. Um, but yeah, so I also found a few things like all these weird things. 
I also have a pig hat on, as you guys can see, and some name tags, some mushrooms, uh, just stuff like that. So, yeah, I guess that's pretty much it, guys. I just wanted to show you guys what I did, and, like, like if we count all the time that I spent, I would say, like, hmm, I would say, like, three or four episodes that would have been, or something like that. So yeah, that I unfortunately guys, that is gonna be it for this episode, guys. As always, if you do like this video, make sure to smack that like button. And if you really like this video, guys, make sure to hit the subscribe button. But this has been Jim Eleven, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.